Bell for today's Meditation Monday. We're in San Francisco. So I think most of you recognize the famous bridge in the background. I thought that would be a nice spot to do our, our meditation today. And today's less of a meditation and more of a contemplation that actually we want to contemplate this new year and I wanted to contemplate our intentions for the year and particularly our intentions to be mindful. What does mindfulness mean? We could say many things, but here we're just going to focus on the idea of the, the ubiquitous phrase being in the present moment. Why do we want to be in the present moment in 2021? And uh, Actually, it doesn't really matter what the year is when we're talking about being present. It doesn't matter because we're just talking about being present in the moment. It doesn't matter what year. But let's pretend and uh, let's set an intention. So this is you personally. I hope that you can set an intention this year to try to remember to come back to your real experience your real experience is happening in the present. Not the imagination of the future, not the mental imagery, memory of the past, but the place where you actually live, the place where you actually have agency, the place where your life is actually happening in real time, the present moment. So feel yourself right now watching this video. Feel yourself right now in the present. You have a body and your senses are working. You're watching this video, but you're also hearing things in the room you're in. You're seeing other things. You're feeling your body. You have your emotions in the present moment, present moment emotions rising up, informing your experience, and you have your mind in the present moment. You have your mental experience, your thoughts, and the space of the mind. And why is the present so powerful? It's powerful because all of our great human values already live there in the present moment. I can already feel the others that I'm with. I can notice their responses. I can feel some sense of their experience just by seeing them, just by hearing them, just by sensing them, my emotional responses. We don't have to have elaborate moralities or rule systems. We can remember just by being with each other, just by sensing each other. And being in the present moment allows me to steer in real time at a very subtle level. The more subtle I can be with being in the present moment, the more subtlety I can sense. All of our greater human capacities live here. And being in the present moment is where your joy is, where your life is. We think that we feel joy because we're at a wedding, or we think we're, we feel joy because we're with a newborn child, or we're at a sporting event. But it's the opposite. Actually, all of those things sometimes give us enough joy, <laughs> or airplanes flying over for that matter. Is that a boat? They give us enough present moments Let's see what that is. Aha, it's a helicopter. The present moment interrupts our agendas. And that's very good. That's very good. Yeah, so 
the wedding or the sporting event actually is our excuse to feel present. And the presentness is the joy. The presentness is the joy. It's the profundity. It's the intelligence. It's the connection. We feel connected in the present. That's the most powerful thing. I hope you have a fantastic year and I hope that you remember every moment of that year that there's something very good built into you, the present.